Hey everybody, fall is in the air, and what better time to go craft shopping? Stick around. Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is Paul Knapp coming to you once again from the Man Cave, and we just went shopping. I went shopping at the dollar store, Five Below, and Michael's Craft Store. So I'm gonna show you what I picked up. And this is fall, which means Halloween is right around the corner. I'm sure the Halloween stuff has been out at most stores probably over a month now, but uh, this is the best time of the year for those of you that do crafting to get this kind of stuff cheap. So let's take a closer look at what I picked up. So once again, this is not all from the dollar store. Most of it is, uh, and most of it, I would say, could go with either 132nd scale all the way up to... Uh, 1-6 scale, you know, G.I. Joe, Adventure Team stuff. I mean, you can't go wrong with skulls, right? We could use those all year round. Indiana Jones, uh, Dungeons and Dragons dioramas, whatever you're looking for, Adventure Team stuff. Uh, these bags of bones, I mean, I mean, look at that, man, for a buck. They even come in this color. And you could you could paint them. You could break them up, uh, use them as dioramas. That's what I do, okay? These, uh, look at these crates. I mean, check out these wood pallets. I mean, I can't make it that cheap under a buck. You know, I picked up a couple of those from the dollar store. Now, this, these I did get at uh, Michael's, but it's a whole container full of flies, which would be so cool having these large flies with a 1-6 scale diorama. These things were a buck. Now, this one is gray. These are perfect for camouflage, either, you know, now here's a tan one that I had used before. You cut those up. You can use those for 132nd scale uh, dioramas, you know, 112 scale, you know, bunkers, whatever. These little hay bales, a buck. Yep, 132nd scale ones. These would be 1 6 scale ones, a buck. Of course, you got all different types of uh, skeletons and skulls. You got three of these for a buck. I mean, you could break that up and set it on the ground, paint it up. They look great. Now, these I picked up at Michael's, and they come in a pack of four. But they are perfect for one six scale, you know, if you're making some type of haunted area or, you know, graveyard. I mean, they are perfect. I can't make it that cheap out of foam and that good. Uh, so this I picked up at Five Below. Now, it's a, it's a fan on top with a light in the middle of it. Let me show you this thing. This thing lifts up. You could easily paint this thing up. You pull this thing up. And there's a lantern underneath it. I mean, that is straight out of Star Wars, man, right? I mean, one six scale or even one thirty second scale, you can make some giant, you know, thing out of that. And then, and it actually works for five bucks. Can't go wrong there, man. Of course, more skeletons, uh, spider's web. You could use that all year round. Now let's get into the uh, the Barbie stuff that I still think is pretty close to one six scale, and you could use. So starting off, we have this pink grill, which I painted one here black which I think looks great. Again, a little small for 1-6 scale, but you could definitely put something under it and lift it up. They got these recycled trash cans, which are perfect scale. I put a bunch of uh, those little miniature junk things that I picked up. Uh, made it look like trash. These chairs and recliner are perfect. So is the table. You just gotta paint that up. It even comes with an umbrella. You can put on top of this one. I mean, come on, man. I can't make that, you know, that cheap and that quick. Now these things I picked up at five below. These are the salt, Himalayan salt lamps, but they change colors, man. And I was thinking, uh, you know, straight out of Tomb Raider or Raiders of the Lost Ark, you could easily make uh, use that as a diorama. These were at Michael's. Um, I picked up other ones in the past. They have a dog and a cat, but I thought the skeleton of the uh, scorpion was kind of cool. Again, you could cut that up. We have a, a rat. I got this at the dollar store for a buck. Um, these things were at Michael's, but I think they were only a dollar. They were three, four dollars. These are the containers that uh, other people have used and painted them up. This was a dollar. Check this out. It's like a ball and it's hollow. You can unscrew that. You can put a light in there and have it as a crystal ball or something like that. These things are cool too. Uh, these are just smaller bones and skeletons. Skeleton bones, skulls, and you could easily paint those up. I've done that in the past. These little containers, again, dollar store, you get like six of them in a, in a container. 
You can put different stuff inside it like I did here. Now I'm currently working on a 1-6 scale Barbie townhouse for somebody and people always ask me, where do you find that background? Where do you find the wallpaper? Where do you find the flooring? I tell them Michaels, you know, this is just paper, but that is perfect for a background or for tile floor. How about this one for wood floors? And I'm going to show you the house that I'm working on right now and you'll see what I mean. Now this is still work in progress here. But I just wanted to show you the stuff that I had picked up at the dollar store. Um, this peel and stick it's supposed to be before back backsplashes, I guess. Looks great on this bathroom floor, right? This a dollar. This a dollar. A little bit small for GI Joe, but it could work in the background. This cabinet here, a buck. That plastic couch is a dollar. You can see how this scale looks with the Barbie doll in it. But all this paper, the background paper. That's all paper, I didn't paint that. Sparkly pink paper, it's all 99 cents. There's the wood flooring. Two sheets of that, 99 cents. I picked up this pool table, dollar store, for a buck. I just made the bottom to it. Two chairs for a buck. I painted two of those up black and I put them in the Adventure Team vehicle, uh, MSV, so they had extra chairs. But yeah, this is all Dollar Store or Michaels, but still, the Michaels stuff was only a buck as well. So, I'm going to show a video on uh, how I made this later, but I just guys wanted to see some of the things I picked up at the Dollar Store. And again, this is the perfect time of year, so if you guys are out looking for crafts, looking for stuff cheap, check out the Dollar Store, man. Halloween, this is the time of year for crafters. And as always, keep on collecting. The face and I wanna get lost. I'm sick of this place. Don't know how to stop when I'm feeling this way. So I'm taking six shots till I'm feeling okay. I think I'm going crazy. Don't think I'll get on safe. So I'm taking six shots all straight to the face. I'm taking six shots. Are you coming with me? I'm taking six shots, yeah, straight to the face.